It was 5.30 a.m. when ICE came to Esther's apartment. ICE stands for Immigration and Customs Enforcement. The agents lied to Esther, saying they were police officers investigating a crime and her husband, Alexi, was a potential witness. Is Alexi home? They asked innocently. Now Esther's gut told her she should cooperate, but she remembered something she'd heard on the radio. ICE had been making early morning sweeps using tricks like this to get people to open their doors. Esther remembered she had rights. ICE may try similar tricks at your home. They may say they're looking for a friend, relative, or roommate. But do not be fooled, and do not open the door. Instead, remain calm and be polite. Tell the agents that you'd like to see a warrant and their ID. Ask them to slip these documents under the door or hold them up to the peephole. Without a warrant signed by a judge, ICE is not allowed to enter or search your home. ICE usually won't have a warrant, but they may lie and say they do or show you something else that looks official. So look carefully and take pictures of whatever they show you. If they refuse to share any of these documents, then ask them for their card and contact information. Do not show the agents anything or say anything, except, I do not consent for you to enter my home. I do not want to talk to you without a lawyer present. Please leave. Now, ICE won't always listen to you and may enter your home using force. But saying these things might help you in court, even if the agents don't listen. The other videos in this series will help you understand your rights if ICE enters your home or arrests you. Esther and Alexi knew their rights, and the officers left. This is all scary. But remember, we have rights. After an encounter with ICE, take notes about what happened, writing down as many details as you can remember. This information might be helpful in future immigration proceedings. It's important that you and your loved ones are prepared for encounters with ICE, and that you have a plan for what to do if one of you is arrested, including information about who to call. If ICE comes to your home, remember, you have rights. Do not open the door. Ask to see a warrant signed by a judge. Tell them you do not consent to them being at your home. Please leave. If a loved one is arrested, you should be able to locate them at locator.ice.gov.